Hi everyone, today's video is going to be a little breakdown of how I have a night to myself. Let's be real, I, I spend every night by myself. I live by myself, but I have my little baby girl, my little puppy. But, um, you know, I do spend a lot of time just me, myself, and I, and obviously right now we're all at home a lot and i thought it would be nice to just show you what i do to kind of differentiate between the work day and then like a nice night to myself kind of like not i wouldn't say it's a date with myself but it's just kind of like chilling with me myself and i and i just wanted to show you a little breakdown of how i would have some more special alone time for myself. No, 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 we're not gonna go that special. We're not gonna go that special right now. Obviously, you know I love skincare so, so, so much. It's a huge part of my self-care routine. So that's a great place to start. Let's get going on the skincare. The skincare portion of this video is sponsored by Bare Minerals, and I'm so excited to talk about their skin longevity range because it's such a gorgeous range. It's vegan, it's cruelty-free, no sulfates, no phthalates, I can never say that word, phthalates, um, no synthetic fragrance, and it's just great. I love their skincare so much. So let's get into the skincare so I can show you more about the products. The products are formulated with something called Boosted Long Life Herb, which is a mineral-rich plant extract from Japan. And they also have botanical extracts such as Californian poppy. These products are powerful treatments for any age group and they're going to help soften fine lines and wrinkles, reduce puffiness. I really, really love these products. They feel great on the skin. I've already cleansed my skin and now I'm going in with the Bare Minerals Skin Longevity Long Life Herb Serum. This is a lightweight serum treatment. It's a treatment because it has 2% vitamin C and 3% niacinamide, which is also known as vitamin B3. And that ingredient helps to protect and strengthen the skin barrier as well as soften fine lines and wrinkles. I love serums so much. Serums are my favorite skincare product. And I will also say, don't forget the neck. Make sure you're putting that serum onto your neck as well because your neck is part of your face. After I've applied the serum, I'm going to go in with my night cream. This is the Bare Minerals Skin Longevity Long Life Herb Night Treatment. It's a gel cream consistency. It's so gorgeous. All you have to do is apply it like a normal moisturizer, apply it to the face and the neck as the last step of your skincare routine. So it's gonna lock everything in. It's full of hyaluronic acid, which we all love because it attracts and retains moisture. And for me, especially in the colder months, I really, really, really need all the moisture I can get on my skin. A good night cream like this one is really important because it's gonna do all the work for you while you're sleeping. So definitely do not miss this step. I am not an expert facial massager person, but I do have a really tight jaw and usually when I'm stressed, I like grind my teeth and that sort of thing. So I just try to do a few motions, especially around the jaw, that just help to loosen everything up and relieve some tension. So every night before bed, I just do a few little movements like that. After the night treatment, I'm gonna go in with my Skin Longevity Long Life Herb Eye Treatment. I love eye creams so much. I am staring at a computer all day long, and when I'm not staring at my computer, I'm staring at my phone. So my eyes get really tired, and I'm definitely noticing that they can look a little bit tired. So just apply a little bit of the eye treatment and gently tap it around the eye area. Use this twice daily as well. You can apply it in the morning, and you can obviously apply it here in the evening. It has those amazing ingredients in there like I've already spoken about, so again, don't miss this step. It also helps to reduce fine lines around the eyes as well as reduce the look of dark circles. And last but certainly not least is the Bare Minerals Skin Longevity Green Tea Herbal Eye Mask. These are cooling hydrogel eye masks and they help reduce puffiness and help nourish the eye area. So one really cool thing about these is that you can put them over top of your eye cream. So I'm just gonna put these in place and leave it on for 15 minutes. And in that time, let's go to the kitchen because I am going to make some popcorn. Please tell me if I'm the only person who thinks this, but I associate popcorn with like really special comforting times. 
I don't eat popcorn that often, so whenever I decide to make popcorn, it feels really like special to me and I really look forward to it. I can't explain it, but let me know if you do the same thing. I am going to eat this entire bowl, trust me when I say, because I love it so much and it really is a treat. So like I said, after about 15 minutes, go take your eye patches off. I didn't mention this earlier, but these babies are infused with willow herb extract and green tea. And I'm always really interested in what ingredients are in products, so I thought those were two really cool ingredients. So just take these little eye masks off and then just tap in any excess product around your eye area so you can really get the most out of the product. I love using products like these eye masks because it's something that you can see an instant little boost and it's just really fun. So now I'm gonna head on over to the couch, to the couch, to the couch, to the couch. Yes, it's time to chill. I've got my popcorn, I've got my dog. You know, spend at least an hour deciding what I wanna watch on Netflix. Lately, I've been watching a show called Ratchet, which is kind of scary, I guess. Um, it's not too scary, but it's kind of scary, but I just really enjoy watching that show. So put on an episode of that and it's time to let the stress of life melt away. After I've spent a very long evening on the couch eating popcorn, it is time for some bedtime. I really try, I'm trying, I don't do it every night, but I try to not go on my phone at least an hour before bed. So one way that I've been trying to do this, and I mean really do this, is make a cup of tea. I love my herbal tea, um, something with no caffeine before bed. I especially love yogi tea because on the little tea tag thing, it has a little phrase or a little something to think about and it always kind of helps me get in the right mood to relax and reflect and that sort of thing. So make my tea and bring it into my room. Usually Effie is already like, okay, we're going to bed. She loves going to bed, just like me. Like I just really love going to bed. When it's bedtime, I'm like, yes, been waiting all day for this. <laughs> so get into bed and hang out with her for a bit and then I will start reading my book. Um, the book I'm reading right now is called Wherever You Go, There You Are, and it's a book about meditation and that sort of thing. So I'm really trying to do that, especially during these times, you know, spending a lot of time upstairs in my brain. So just trying to, you know, think about things in a, maybe a different way. So I'm reading that book, and yeah, that's that's pretty much that's pretty much my night. I mean, that is my idea of a great time. If if somebody said to me you get one night to yourself, those are the things I wanna do. It's simple, but yeah, take care of my skin, take care of my stomach and eat some popcorn, watch some TV, read a great book, fall asleep. Amazing, I must be getting older. <laughs> so that's it for me. I would love to know what your ideal night with yourself would look like. I think maybe if you asked me a couple of years ago, I'd be like, let's go clubbing. Obviously we're not doing that now, but um, yeah, it's really changed for me. And this is my ideal night in with myself. I hope you enjoyed this video and I hope it inspired you to try to carve out some special time with just yourself because it's really important to do that. And trust me, it does feel different when you have an intention behind it. So yeah, that's it from me and I will see you very soon. Bye.